But now we have an exciting new film with two Hollywood big, big stars. You'll know Anya Taylor-Joy from things like The Queen's Gambit. If you haven't seen it, why not? You're crazy. Emma and Peaky Blinders. And Alexander Skarsgård, of course, from Big Little Lies, uh, The Legend of Tarzan, True Blood and loads of other stuff. Uh, now the pair are starring in a brand new action movie, not for the faint-hearted, called The Northman. It sees uh, a young Viking prince who's on a quest to avenge his father's murder. Well, we have the Vogue cover star here with us in person, Anya Taylor-Joy and Alexander Skarsgård. Good morning to both of you. Um, I have to say that I was astonished we could find 23 seconds that we could show <laughs> on live TV when the children are at home. Because, I mean, this... It's that was not... perfect morning television, yeah, that clip. Exactly. Right, were you two thinking... Good morning, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's an incredible... Um, it's an incredible watch. I, I, could, I couldn't stop watching, if that makes sense, which is, of course, what you want films to do, but sometimes in films you think, oh, when's it over? You couldn't catch your breath. Um, it's very artistic and brutal, and I didn't know until I read this, uh, Alexander, that you, obviously, were heavily involved in wanting to bring this particular story to, to life. Tell me why. Um... I can't really take um, credit for the particular story, um, but I had a a dream of making a um, a big epic Viking movie based on the old Icelandic sagas, the the Edda sagas, um, and I was together with uh, Lars Knutsen, my producing partner, for 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 a couple of years going through the sagas and trying to figure out which um, which one to base it on, or if we should base it on a historical figure, or, but, but it wasn't until I met Robert Eggers um, about five years ago, um, and it turned out that Rob was a big fan of Norse mythology, had just been to Iceland and fell in love with the country and the culture and the people, and uh, um, and we decided to to team up and and, uh, and, and do this together, and, and, and then Rob, together with the Icelandic author and poet Sean, um, wrote the, the screenplay that ultimately became the movie The Northman. So um, I can't take any credit for the, uh, uh, for the actual story that, that, that ultimately became the movie that we did. Yeah, but but, I mean, uh, it's, it's, it's been brutal. exciting as an actor to be part of that whole journey um, from the beginning, which is quite rare. Often you get yeah. sent something that's already packaged and done, um, and it's been really inspiring to, to be there from the genesis of the project. Um, but, Anya, I mean, were there moments when you were filming that you just thought, a bit of CGI wouldn't go amiss? This is hard work. I mean, watching it, I was thinking, <laughs> this is all real. I mean, you were really... You were outside in bitter, bitter weather for the, almost the entirety of your time on screen. Yep. And I really thought about you when I was watching it. I was like, whoa. Oh... Well, thank you very much. I actually had the time of my life. I think I was very annoying on set because... <laughs> Especially coming out of lockdown, I was just so excited to be making art and working with people that I love so much. And I'm a real lover of nature, so I was kind of like flitting around like a little fairy, being like, "This is amazing! It's not cold." Um, yeah, I really. And you really and Rob already it. had a shorthand because you did yeah. the witch together, so you already mm -hmm. um, knew. It, it, Rob has a very particular style of, this is of the, filmmaking. This is the yes, director he does. for with, those who um, don't know. Yeah, almost. Oh, sorry, sorry, yes. Robert Eggers, the, the, the director. Uh, uh, he loves long takes, uh, scenes with no cuts, just one camera move, the whole scene. So, um, which is quite unusual, especially when it comes to a big action adventure movie. Mm -hmm. yeah. Movies like that are, in, they're just not shot that way. You and have plenty of It's incredibly of cuts. ambitious. So when you're yes. dealing with the elements, plus the oneers, plus everything, it's kind of... Um, once you finish the day, if you got the shot, you feel incredibly accomplished. And yeah. can I just yeah. say, um, Alexander, you mean, you are, like, naked from the waist up almost all the entire time in there, and your body looks very different to the way you look now. That in itself must have been quite a feat. What did you have to do to inhabit this, you know, huge Viking prince character? Because physically, it's different. You sounded so disappointed when you said no. that. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody works as hard as this man. I honestly can't say enough about I mean, how much effort and love he poured into this role, me. and you can really see it. I mean, dude, you fill the entire screen. Right. <laughs> uh, I'm blushing now, guys. This is very, this is very uncomfortable for me. Uh, um, well, my character... 
This is very uncomfortable. I, uh, <laughs> my character is a berserker, and his name is Bjorn Ulfur, which means bear wolf. Um, it, no pressure. There's this, exactly, so there's like, <laughs> no, I don't look exactly like a bear, uh, um, but I wanted to, so I, I, I with a lot of help from uh, Magnus Ludbuck, uh, uh, a trainer I, I've worked with on other movies we did, Tarzan together many years ago, and uh, I tr we tried to basically put on some some weights up so I would look uh, uh, a bit more like a bear, I guess. Incredible. Mm -hmm. You were eating a lot, you know weren't that. you? <laughs> I heard you having like five meals a day and... There was... A <clears throat> I had basically five meals for breakfast uh, <laughs> and then and four or five months <clears throat> before we, we started the principal photography on the movie, uh, Magnus and I started training and... Um, and yeah, just to kind of uh, and, try to put on some weight. And, yeah, and which sounds like a dream, by the way. You think, oh goodness, I get to eat five meals for breakfast, but it it is actually really arduous. <laughs> I felt for you. You know, it's really cold, it's muddy, and you just see Alex there, just like with the salmon again, just going for it. Um, yeah. And before you go, of course, I must mention Nicole Kidman um, plays your mum in this. But for those of you who've seen you and her on screen before, that will come as quite a surprise. Um, yeah, it's it's a very, <clears throat> uh, I would say, very different relationship from when Nicole and I worked together on Big Little Lies. But but yet again, we were able to find something really dark, twisted, dysfunctional, mm. uh, disturbing. Um, so we've decided to go do a light rom-com next. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Because um, it's been, <laughs> it's yeah, been that, I think that's the plan. It's been heavy going. Well, it is yeah, absolutely... But it, was, it was absolutely... It, it was amazing to be reunited with Nicole on this. Um, uh, she is um, a force of nature and a lovely, lovely person to work with. So um, working together on Big Little Lies was in, intense because of the nature of the, yeah. the show, but it was a very bonding experience. To be reunited was um, an absolute dream. Well, um, I wish we had more time to talk to you, but that is the nature of uh, live TV. But thank you so much to both of you uh, for joining us this morning. Anya looks gorgeous on the front of Vogue as well. They're calling you Hollywood royalty, uh, which is lovely. Thank you so much. Hollywood um, royalty. You... Absolutely. <laughs> this one's only ever seen me covered in mud. Yeah. So. <laughs> I'm a bear and she's Hollywood royalty. Right, that's it. You better live with that, Alex. <laughs> uh, thank you so much to both of you. Uh, you can watch uh, North Man in the cinemas uh, from the 22nd of April, but you've got to have a strong stomach for it, I'm telling you now. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.